Oh, hi there, boys and girls. Bailey J here. The good folks at NoboFeed.com have asked me to answer some of your questions in honor of Valentine's Day, if you couldn't tell by my $3 budget. So let's begin, shall we? Our first question comes from a nice lady who tweeted to me, how should I surprise my husband for Valentine's Day? Sexy lingerie, maybe some chocolate dipped strawberries? Anal, that's always the answer. So have a glass of wine, buy lots of lube, and don't eat any oatmeal or drink any coffee 24 hours beforehand. Your husband will thank you. Well, now here's an interesting one. I have erectile dysfunction, but I want to get my wife off. Do you have any tips? Yes, I do. What you need to do is find yourself some lesbian porn to learn some pointers, but like real lesbian porn, none of that fluffy acrylic nail fake lesbian porn. You need bull dykes with buzzed heads who hand fuck like they're starting a lawnmower. There's plenty of ways to get a woman off, even if you don't have an erection. be the worst person to spend Valentine's Day with, in your opinion? Well, obviously Bill Cosby. So I'll say Suzanne Summers. I just feel like she would talk about estrogen therapy and eating raw oysters and sex over 60. Yeah, I feel like she'd make it very uncomfortable to hang out with on Valentine's Day. I want to buy a quality dildo or vibrator. What is it that you look for when you buy a quality dildo or vibrator? Well, I'm a little Gwyneth Paltrow when it comes to dildos and vibrators. I'm very particular about what I put in my body, on both ends. So I say medical grade silicone. It's the way to go. Anything that says jelly dong or anything like that, head to the hills, because that stuff is usually from China and it'll burn your butthole. What you want is a nice medical grade silicone dildo, preferably one with a suction cup. And if you can afford it, I would invest in hardwood floors. <laughs> now here's a question I get a lot. I'm gonna assume it's from a man. Am I gay for jerking off to your videos? Well, yes. You're gay now. That's how it works, Mary. It's kind of like Teen Wolf, only you're slowly gonna turn into Rip Taylor. So, I guess I'll see you at Pride, homo. Well, that was so good I needed a cigarette. I hope I was able to offer some illuminating advice for you on this most joyous occasion of Valentine's Day. The one day of the year where you're supposed to stop emotionally neglecting your loved one. So, uh, enjoy.